and last thing on Yellow Beezy, I think, I think now I feel like it's his time to be. He could turn into a Yo Gotti if he wanted to. Yeah, we on Boss Talk One On One. One On One. Yeah, we gonna talk. Your social media and the fans speak for a lot of shit. Yeah, right. yeah, the fans, yeah. The, the fans dictate a lot of shit. And like I told y'all earlier, you read them comments, the fans will really make you believe the shit they saying. Mm -hmm. That shit is the devil. Mm -hmm. Wow, shout out to have, well, Yellow Beezy said that other channel, he didn't. He couldn't think of my channel name, and he said, uh, <laughs> uh, what did he say? He that said, shit hurt you, didn't it? Uh, it it kind of made you it feel It kind of like, made me feel like I need <laughs> to work hard. It don't ever hurt me. It yeah, motivates me. Yeah. It never, think about it. If something hurt me, I'd have no, I, I, yeah, I, I, it motivates I mean. yeah, everything I mean. that happens for boss talk motivates like you gotta realize we, we dealing with some of the biggest names ever yeah. I'm dealing with some people that's way bigger than mm. I've no, been pop doing your shit. pop I'm your being shit real. pop your I'm shit nigga. Too. I mean, <laughs> shit, nigga. you gotta think about it. you never know who you might see in here sitting in this seat they yeah. fly in and come on boss talk now so mm -hmm. that little that part right there don't trip but the respect I have for him right. you know what I mean I definitely would think that he knows that boss talk is in, in the city mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying but at the end plus he done called here talking to low D's a few times but at any rate uh he was mad about the camera, man. I got to talk to Half Pint. Half Pint just left off the show. We were saying that you wasn't going to drop the video. We didn't know when you was going to drop oh, it. Oh, no, no, no. So so it was about this camera that came up, Lil Ron and me done talked about it on here. Well, what camera? The, that he didn't buy Half Pint oh. a camera. And it got mentioned on here. Oh, yeah. I, I, and I do want to say this. The Yellow Beezy interview took so long to come out because I had a, the YouTube had banned me for a week. What? Yeah. Why would they ban you? Uh, I, 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 I don't want to. Well, it was a strike. They had gave me a what? strike. What? You yeah. playing games like that? No, it was an old video. They came back after a yeah, while. Yeah, like, wow. what the fuck? So it took a week. And I told Yellow B, he was like, when the video dropping, I said tomorrow. Then that's when I got the strike. So I had to wait a whole week. Wow. Yeah, that's what made it, that's what made it took so long. How Everybody do, was asking about that shit, too. But how do you, how you know that, that. But strikes go away after 30 days. I know that. Yeah. But, but but how do you feel when, because what if three strikes came up right back, back, back? That would kill. Yeah, but I don't have, I, I went back and looked and like my shit good. I don't even know where that came from. So Wow. Man. Man, kudos to you, man, yeah. for figuring it out. But no, I think I think like I said, the, the interview was slamming the fact that you even done it. Mm -hmm. like, like, you know, the fact that they that that real life came together, that mm -hmm. that Terry Blue came on there, um, that you know that half pint came through. You know, I didn't know all of those guys. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? But I just like the unity, just yeah. the fact of trying, that was, just to even yeah, that try. Cool. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. So um, yeah, um, I think. Um, and last thing on Yellow Beezy, I think. I think now I feel like it's his time to be. He could turn into a Yo Gotti if he wanted to. Go out and get a few young artists and just just be big homie. Yeah, mm -hmm. I feel like now because it's like it's hard to have two runs. I mean, it can happen, but like you had that crazy run. You know what I'm saying? And it's like you proved yourself already. Mm -hmm. You have a platform now. So now get it's a lot of young talent out here now. A lot of people checking on Texas. Period. Dallas for sure, but you know Texas. It's a lot of things floating around Texas. That's that that could be something. And I feel like Yellow Beezy, his his brand will last longer if he turned into that. If he started the whole label, wow. do you think he wants that second run, or do you? Think I think he wants to go on another run, which I don't blame him for. I mean, we're all competitive. We all want to see if we could, you know, how long we could do something for. But I feel like, you know, if he finds something that we both like, I wouldn't mind partnering up with him. So right. I just partnered up with, with, with uh, Rain. Rain, Rain. I don't give a fuck about, like I told you, I don't care about sharing. Yeah. I don't care about going 50 50 on, 50 50 on something is better than 0 0 on nothing. That's real. So That's real. A lot of people don't want to eat with other people because they don't want to see that person eat. Mm -hmm. I don't give a fuck who eating with me. I just want to make sure I'm eating. Wow. Do you think that um, y'all coming together solved anything? Yeah, it created a lot of, a lot, a lot of people that haven't spoken before, they're speaking now. And they want to redo that again. Like they want to do it different. Like they want to have like, like you said, like monthly, like like when we talked about at the end of the video about all the DJs agreeing on five songs to play in the, in, in the club. Like mm. that shit really helps. Cause when I asked Mr. Hit that, I said, so you're telling me y'all don't get together and agree on to push one song? Y'all don't do that? He was like, nah, we don't do that. What? That goes on in every city where the DJs have a sit down and they agree on what song they're going to push. What song is not reacting? What song is reacting? What song we should press more, play more? Like, y'all don't do that? 
it that shit blew my sense. mind. A lot sense. of people was lost when he said they don't do that. Like, wow. That's why I, I, I was like, me, me and Half Pine and all the blogs. If we can, just think about if we all agreed on one artist and pushed them, that'd be hard. They may not blow. They might though. Yeah, yeah. That's what Chief said. You post been doing a long time ago. Man, fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> but don't fuck the DJs Chief. have like an organization? Like, um, here? yeah, they used to have like yeah. the definition, yeah. definition and the DJs shit like that. Definition like, they DJ, don't have yeah. that anymore. They still cool. had a name, but they don't have meetings. That's they just don't like have the uh -uh. you know, like the gangs don't have meetings no more and shit. Like in the L in LA, they don't do the weekly meetings no yeah, more. Yeah, but it's more about more. I hate to say it, it's more about the bloggers. <sighs> It's more turning toward the bloggers and the interviewers and stuff like that. I still like think that. DJs. The DJs is the dopest. Don't get me the music and it being out there in that in that in the each club. I agree, mm. but the bloggers and the interviewers it has a lot of impact. People are watching. Look how many views you get, man. Yeah. You you do better than anybody to me in Texas. You yeah. the biggest in the South when it come down to some elements, man. Yeah. So you know um, maybe and and you killing all other regions as well, yeah. but. That's a that's a lot of impact, bro. Mm -hmm. So I just think it's a lot more station. It's a lot more aimed at that. Yeah. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk.